a gay mark of this production. Hello viewers and welcome to another edition of ARC News. I'm your host Archivist and today I will be going through three topics related to either the gaming or tech world at the moment. So first off, it turns out the Wii U is actually starting to become popular over here in the UK. The console's UK sales jumped 685% in early October after Nintendo released a limited edition Wii U to go along with the HD release of the immensely popular Legend of Zelda Wind Waker. While I thought that Wind Waker was an awesome game, I find it amusing that a GameCube re-release could potentially be the reason for the Wii U success over here. I suppose it just shows off how effective Nintendo are at creating timeless classics. Samsung have announced the first smartphone to feature a curved screen known as the Samsung Galaxy Round. In terms of specs, this thing is no slouch. The handset will feature a 1080p screen, a 2.3GHz quad-core processor, a 13 megapixel camera and 3GB of RAM. It's encouraging to hear that Samsung aren't going to simply sell this phone based on its gimmick, but also back it up with some pretty impressive hardware. Although it may be hard to see the benefits of a curved screen at first, there are a few. First off, the handset will be easier to hold as the shape will fit the palm of your hand. Also, the curvature can create a sort of surround effect if observed directly, even on a 5.7 inch display. We are getting to that time of year again when all the AAA games come out and I for one love it. On the 25th we have Batman Arkham Origins, on the 29th Assassin's Creed Black Flag is being released, on November 1st there's Battlefield 4, on the 5th comes Call of Duty Ghosts, and finally on the 15th we have Lego Marvel Super Heroes. It truly is a great time to be a gamer, not to mention the fact the next gen consoles are on the way. If I had to choose only one game from the list I mentioned, it would probably be Assassin's Creed, believe it or not. The Caribbean setting really appeals to me and I love the series in general. For more information on Arkham Origins, AC4, Call of Duty Ghosts and LEGO Marvel, be sure to check out the preview videos that are available on my channel, as well as preview videos for other games that I didn't mention here, such as Destiny and Infamous Second Son. This was another episode of ARK News, I hope you enjoyed it. As always people, thanks very much for watching, and see you next time.